When I first started working with Bev Morgan and Bob Kirby in 1975, I never imagined that this company would turn into what it has turned into. Uh, we started out in a small operation in Santa Barbara, and all we had were a couple of drill presses, and a grinding room, small toolbox with hand tools in it, and a little tiny rack about the size of this panel right here that contained all of our inventory. At that time, I started working with uh, the Kirby 16, which then moved into the, the Superlight 17. And here we are 40 something years later, 45, 46 years later. And the way we do things has changed dramatically. Uh, we still use our hands a lot. We still use some of the old techniques we used years ago, but now we've got stuff like this. We have CNC lathes, we have CNC mills, we have several of each. Uh, we've got laser cutters, CMM measuring equipment for quality control, uh, water jet cutters, 3D printers, on and on and on. And that was all Bev's vision. Bev wanted to have the best possible equipment to allow us to do the best possible job for the equipment that we're designing for the commercial divers. His philosophy has always been safety, safety, safety. And that's what we adhere to today. Each time we use one of these machines, it brings us to ideas for the next use and the next piece of equipment. We're looking at uh, scanners, laser scanners, digitizers, all sorts of stuff for the future. And the future's pretty bright. We never, we never would have imagined that we'd be here right now with all this equipment, but here we are. Uh, we have, I think, 75 employees, and we started out with four. Uh, so, so you can tell that we've come a long, long way since 1975. Here's another example of one of the machines that we use for producing parts in-house. This is a, a Haas mini mill. Don't let the, the size of the machine fool you. This machine is capable of a lot of different things. One of the things that we're doing on this is the side block for the new mask. This is a pretty complicated little part. Um, this machine handles quite a bit of it. Uh, I think it's got eight different tools on here and it takes a little while to make this thing, but the accuracy and the quality is excellent. Really, really good. Here's another part that gets partially done on here. The hex and a couple of other operations are done on here, the, the holes around here. And this piece is made out of titanium. So we do a lot of stuff in house that we wouldn't do out of house normally because uh, the, our quantities are lower and uh, outsourcing a lot of the, the uh, parts costs a lot more money because of what we have to order and the cost of the, the uh, materials. But the advantage of doing it in house is the, the level of quality that we can apply. And this is, is checked step by step. Each, each operation is checked with, uh, with the CMM machines and the uh, instant measuring machines. So this is the highest level of quality that we can, that we can do. If we were to do this out, outsource, we, we wouldn't be getting this because we'd have to walk through every step of the process outside the house and that's not gonna happen. This is the way to go. Almost everything on the mask is made in-house, all the machine parts, the plastic and everything is done, is purchased from a, an outsource for uh, injection molding and, and rubber compression and, and injection. But all the machine parts are made in-house.